Hello everyone and welcome back to the Letterhead Studios. And today we're going to be playing Hollow Knight. So let's get started. Mmm, I love it already. The music's good, the art style's pretty neat. Uh, ooh. Ooh. Yeah, we're good. Too bright. Yeah, we're good. In wilds beyond, they speak your name with reverence and regret, for none could tame our savage souls. Yet you the challenge met. Under palest watch you taught. We changed. Base instincts were redeemed. A world you gave to bug and beast as they had never dreamed. Okay then, that's pretty cool. kind of experimenting with the controls here a bit. It's pretty simple, I guess. You jump, and you slice. Oh. Oh, okay. Filling up some sort of bar. Oh, by holding down the jump button, I can jump higher. Gotcha. Higher beings, these words are for you alone. Your great strength marks you amongst us. Focus your soul and you shall achieve feats of which others can only dream. Collect soul by striking enemies. Once enough soul is collected, hold B to focus soul and heal. Oh, so I have healing factor. Nice. Well, let's see what's down here. Anything? Ooh, a secret. Ooh, ooh, a secret. Oh, no. Let's do that focus healing thing. Oh, nice. I don't know what these are, but I bet I gotta collect them. Oh, no. Mmm. That hurt. Ooh. What's this? Oh, 
Wait. Now I'm all gooey. No, why did I do that? Oh, I got armor. Goopy armor. Nice. Alright, cool. Nope. Wanna go back? No! Oh boy. Oh. Oh. Race against time. I'm probably not going to be able to collect everything that I see. But I'll, I'll try and grab what I can. Higher beings, these words are for you alone. Beyond this point, you enter the land of king and creator. Step across this threshold and obey our laws. Bear witness to the last and only civilization, the eternal kingdom, Hollow Nest. Okay. Huh. Dirtmouth, the fading town. Eh? Oh! Hello. Oh there, traveler. I'm afraid there's only me left to offer welcome. Our town's fallen quiet, you see. The other residents, they've all disappeared. Headed down that well, one by one, into the caverns below. Used to be there was a great kingdom beneath our town. It's long fell to ruin, yet it still draws folks into its depths. Wealth, glory, enlightenment. That darkness seems to promise all things. I'm sure you too seek your dreams down there. Well, watch out. It's a sickly air that fills the place. Creatures turn mad and travelers are robbed of their memories. Perhaps dreams aren't such great things after all. Oh my. Yay! I guess it's like auto-saving. Yeah? For all your mapping supplies, we will be opening soon. Is Zelda and Cornifer. Well, I guess for now, do I go into the well? What's this? Oh. A stone door with a simple lock. Gotcha. So I bet the key is in the well. Off we go. Bye. Hmm. I just instantly destroy everything I see. I'm terrible. Okay. Yeah, kind of figured out how that works. <sighs> well, now I'm stuck. I, I, I can't decide whether I want to go left or right. Let's go left real quick. Oh, now what? Do I go left or right? Uh, I'm so wrecked with the decision. Oh. Oh, you know what? I bet... I bet those little things aren't collectibles at all. I mean, you can collect them, but I bet it's currency. Can enter this place, okay. 
Sure, why not? Hello? Temple of the Black Egg. Hello there. Goa, Nudo Ilamak. Hello there. How delightful to meet another traveler on these forgotten roads. You're a short one, but you've a strong look about you. I'm Quirrell. I have something of an obsession with uncharted places. This ancient kingdom holds many fascinating mysteries. And one of the most intriguing of them is standing right before us. A great stone egg lying in the corpse of the ancient kingdom. And this egg? Is it warm? It certainly gives off a unique air. Can it be opened? There are strange marks all over it. I do so love mystery. And who knows what other marvels lie even deeper below us. Yeah, I think this was in the opening cinematic. Well, whatever it is, I bet it's trouble. Here I am just destroying stuff. Don't know why. Yeah, get away from me. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> ha. Well, let's see what's up here. Oh no. A trap. That's what's up there. Nope. Okay, well. Now I kind of wonder what was off to the left. I guess I won't know for a while. Oh, that looks like civilization. This looks like more darkness. So many choices. Ah, I'm racked with indecision. Anyone else hear someone content with mining? Oh, bury my mother, pale and slight. Bury my father with his eyes shut tight. Bury my sisters two by two. And then when you're done, let's bury me too. Do you know that one? It's one of my favorites. We can sing something else if you like. You start singing and I'll join in. I bet you have a beautiful singing voice. What are you down here for? If you came to get wealthy, just look around you. These mines are still bursting with riches. There's plenty for everyone, so grab a pick and join in. Okay. Oh, wow. Oops. It left without me. Hmm. She seems quite content. Oh, what is this? Hmm, it just filled me with focus. That doesn't do anything for me. Oh no! No, none of that. None of that. Oh, what was I worried for? Hooray for dead ends! I don't know. Hang on. Let me let me check out what this thing is up here. So I feel like it's civilization of some sort. I could be wrong. But who's to say, right? <sighs> I just see a gate and it makes me think people live here. Mm -hmm. 
Oh! Whoa! Hang on! Ow! Oh no! No! Hang on! Oh boy! That guy is a little tough. Let's try this again. Yeah, okay. guy. I bet you're happy to be free. Got you. Didn't I? <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, I can do an upward swipe. I didn't know that. Oh, that's so cool. Okay, no downward swipe, though. Unless... Yeah! Oh, that's cool. Okay, well, now I know. Ha! I beat my first boss guy. Yeah. Take that. Oh. Uh. Oh no. Nice. Okay, well, there's my defense against that. All right. More coins. A G tab wears if you have coin. But it descends even further down. Oh no. No bueno. Oh no. Well, that sucks. Sure would hate to have a game over on my first episode. Oh god. Wow. What a jerk. No, I don't want to risk that guy. I'll take on that guy, but not not Mr. Leaps. Leaps of plenty. Oh, I I can cheat it. Yeah, all right. Got you, didn't I? Nope. I'm crafty, aren't I? Oh boy, this just keeps getting better and better. It's just like an endless puzzle. back here. 
Okay. Well, I rescued a little caterpillar guy. That was cool. Yeah, I think I would really appreciate a map going in this place. We've done most everything we can to the right, so it's really about exploring what's to the left. Ow. That was mean. So there's this up here, but I'm sure there's something else down below. Something I haven't, oh. Ah! All right, let's get some free shots in, shall we? All right, fill up that focus. That is a lifesaver. Okay. I can go down. Hey! Um, hello there. Come down to explore these beautiful old ruins? Don't mind me. I've a fondness for exploring myself. Getting lost and finding your way again is a pleasure like no other. We're exquisitely lucky, you and I. I'm a cartographer by trade, and I'm working on mapping this area right now. Would you like to buy a copy of my work so far? Sure. Ah, very nice. A map can be a useful thing, but it alone won't show you where you are. If you've not the head for directions, I suggest purchasing a compass from my wife, Iselda. She's just now opening our new map shop in Dirtmouth, selling all sorts of useful things to wanderers like yourself. She'll even sell some of my old maps from time to time. I pop back to see her whenever I finish mapping an area. She's always so excited to see me. <laughs> oh, by the way, I haven't introduced myself, have I? Yes, I should apologize for that. When you spend a lot of time by yourself, with just your own thoughts, you forget the niceties of conversation. My name is Conifer, and I've always loved exploring the world. When I was first hatched, I wandered off immediately, leaving my brothers and sisters and poor mother behind. That's why as soon as I moved to Dirtmouth with my wife, a huge unending kingdom to explore right on my doorstep? Who could resist? Anyway, I'll let you return to your travels. With a little luck, we'll meet again. Be safe, and farewell. <laughs> well, that's nice. So I'm down below. Hey, wait, what's this to the left? It's in the center somewhere. Oh, boy. <laughs> Oh no. I'm in trouble. Ooh, money. Stop it. I want my money. Uh oh. No. Uh, all right. Oh, God, no. Okay. Hang on. Okay. 
We're good, we're safe. I guess... Oh boy. Oh. Ah, it fills me with focus. It's also a dead end. Hmm. You know, I'm honestly not sure where I am. Perhaps we should return to the surface and see about buying a compass. Oh. Well... Hopefully I don't have to fight it again. Bye. I'm out. What the heck? Ooh. Oh, it's in the background. Uh, okay. I bet. Yeah! That's real clever of me, isn't it? Yeah. Except for the part where I got hit. You know, I bet. No? Okay, so the area where Cornifer is, is... The area that has the weird symbol with the long nose? I wanna know what that is, though. But I'm definitely in the area that he hasn't marked yet. That's for sure. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. No. There you go. Yeah. Let's get the heck out of here. Is open. Awesome. Ah, <sighs> Bapanada. Come to buy a map, have you? It's really my husband you should be dealing with, but what a surprise. He's headed down below. He'll pop back occasionally to deliver new maps for the store. But I do wish he'd spend a little more time up here. I'm not much interested in retail myself. Now let's see what we have here for me to sell. Ooh.
Huh. That's cool. I like both of these. Oh, that's cool too. I made these pins so you can keep track of them. The cocoons are pretty, but very delicate. I don't know what they are or what it does. Mark shopkeepers? Oh, I need to start saving up. Well, let's do this first. Well, I'll be back. Thank you, Zelda. Awesome. Well, I think that's it for today. See you guys next time. Until then, stay tuned.